The select operator allows us to target a region of interest for numerous applications, ranging from the upfront filtering through the measurement process to the resulting analysis of the selected surfaces. With this wide range of use, it's no surprise that SELECT is the most common operator found in routines working with point cloud and mesh data objects. It's also no surprise that it has a long list of enhancements requested to make it even more versatile. With PCDMIS 2020R2, we've gone back to the SELECT operator to address the most common requests as well as simplify the user experience. The first thing users will notice is the ability to change both the size and center of the select objects directly in the graphics window. The box, circle, sphere, and polygon all have a drag handle at the center, which allows for repositioning the tool, as well as drag handles on the edges and vertices to allow for resizing. We've also made it more clear what will be included in the selection by optionally highlighting the underlying object without having to click apply. This option is available in the dialog by checking the preview box. Near the preview option is another requested improvement, which allows the select operator to filter only for forward facing points. The operator is created exactly the same way, but now only points in the specified region that also have a vector facing the graphics window view are returned. In addition to the new capability of adjusting size and position, we've also added a depth dimension to limit the selection perpendicular to the view. Once you've positioned the tool as desired, you can adjust the depth by rotating the view and using a drag handle. The center position can also be changed here since it will impact the selection with depth enabled. Quick Select from the Point Cloud toolbar was also improved by adding a double click to finish mouse gesture. Now you will no longer need to be close to the keyboard in order to quickly remove points from the part fixture or table. Thank you to everyone who provided the feedback needed to make these improvements to the select operator. The new options for depth and direction serve the purpose of reducing the total number of operators required, and the added graphic window interaction should help make the creation of the select operators you still need more intuitive. We hope that you'll find the updated select operator is able to provide productivity improvements in PCDMIS 2020 R2.